Ah, yes. The long conveyor belt of death. Just playing. It's just copper, it's not death. Or is it? What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back in Satisfactory. A game where it's all about conveyor belts. Trying to figure out how to maximize and uh, basically make your stuff more efficient. Speaking about efficiency, right now we need to get our health up. Got some pale berries over here. And as you can see, I've been doing a little bit of work, not just uh, not, a, not just a little bit, but a lot. So, let's go ahead and see what we've done. So, I made an extra mine. This extra mine for iron is going all the way over here. It combines and converges into this one, and then it goes into this. And then converges into this splitter, which goes into two iron smelters, and we're so amazing. So this iron smelter goes over to here, which makes our iron rods. We have a splitter that goes here, splits the uh, iron rod, goes over to this way, and then goes into our storage. These iron rods are now going up and down and all around this little kind of roller coaster ride. Boom. And we're making screws. Planet screw. Now we can clock speed now because we have uh, blueprints for a power shard, which is kind of like a battery. But it looks like this... Is everything okay over here? But we've maxed it. We've, we've had to do all kinds of silly stuff to our storage and to our copper. So, the copper roll, the copper line was doing a little bit slow. It's still doing slow. It's not efficient. It's not. But it splits into two different areas. One where we go and it makes uh, copper wire. Copper wire then goes into this area which makes copper uh, cabling. So we got cables. But it goes into a splitter first. So the copper wire comes out of here, splits, goes over into there and also goes out into there for storage. Then to help out with some copper wire because we do need a little bit of copper wire for our episode today goes into a second smelter that second smelter goes over into here I'm making more copper wire and I've had to set up a separate storage space just for copper wire concrete and cables and then over there is mostly the metal parts except for copper wire because I like copper wire don't ask me why so we got lots of efficiencies lots of things that are going on a lot of things are probably not really working all that great, but they, they're working fine right now. Like, we got four storage units just for this stuff. And it's, uh, you know, let's keep them busy. That one's not that full. But this will fill up eventually. Eventually. And then, can I... Am I, am I trapped? Is this the thing? Can it help? Help. Now, we only have this game for uh, a little bit. So when it comes to trying to rearrange stuff, I should rearrange it because it, a little bit of math that goes along uh, in this game, obviously. You know, uh, copper wire takes one for one, but then copper cabling needs two wires and then concrete. Concrete's pretty uh, pretty on point. But to make these, we need one iron rod to make six of these screws. But to make one... One copper plate, two iron ingots. So for every two that pops out, that's the reason why these, you know, not all that great. It's not efficient. That's the reason why we just got a huge blockage over here. I should just get a whole bunch of smelters and just smelt this stuff up. Get another splitter, split that area off, put another thing. It's one of those things where I uh, made everything pretty compact to start our little playthrough here when I really should just have a section for iron a section for copper a section for concrete and then build those around instead of making an all one giant ridiculous hub but that's what I did this time and I'm not mad I'm not sad about it so we have some upgrades I've been knocking out these green power slugs alien catapas and also, we're knocking out all of our logistics, all of our conveyor walls. We can build, we can get them bigger, stronger, better, faster. But these part assemblies we have not messed around with. We do have obstacle clearance, so we have chainsaws now. What? What? Yes, sir. 
Oh, you needed some biofuel. You can make biofuel over here by getting your biomass leaves, biomass wood, and then converting the biomass into biofuel. It's more efficient and it'll help you out. Let's go chop some trees down. Ah! See, while you're thinking locally, I'm thinking globally. I'm locally killing everything about this place. I need shrubberies, I need biomass, I need all, all sorts of doodads, whatnots, hand-me-downs. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. Ah! Makes clearing a breeze, folks. Clearing is a breeze. Now let's go ahead and make some fuel. Now, I'm sure that I can easily have another area here that I have to make biomass for, and I can probably convert it into biofuel. I I just do it like this, man. I'll just do it like this. It's no big deal. It's no big whoop. I'll get over it. But today, what we are going to do... Hold on here. It's almost done. We are going to be making the space elevator. We have the materials. We've grinded. We've grinded. We've grinded. We pulled uh, limestone. Let's get rid of some of the stuff I don't need here. All right. So over on this right-hand side, I've been messing around with some of the platforms because we have these foundations and we have stairs to the right, stairs to the right. But also organization. We have walkways now and lookout towers and extra personal storage units that we can make, and that's all kinds of lovely. So walls. Got all kinds of walls and wall conveyor perpendicular, so I believe we can use these walls to make conveyor belts go around. I don't know. But we're busy beavers. And I've also made ramps going up to this platform. This platform is where I would like to have the space elevator be placed. Floor is too steep. Can't afford encroaching on others. It's just got a whole bunch of rules, Brian. Has a whole bunch of rules. But as far... Uh... That sounded like something went down. Did something go down? Sorry. Excuse me one second. <laughs> gotta double check. Just gotta make sure. I got biomass things all over the joint, man. These biomass generators are clutch, kid. Um, I should... Hmm. Hmm. I should put a pole here. Kind of feed in the power, but eh, it'll be fine. You're gonna be fine. You've got plenty of power. It's beautiful. Okay. So let's go ahead and get ourselves some more copper. Some copper wire. We'll take it out of this side because it's getting us more. Oh my god. It's everywhere. Our storage is getting filled up, baby. Woo! I kind of wanted to put this up here. I don't know if I'll be able to. Floor is too steep. But where isn't too steep? Seems like a really Oh, see so right th oh that's not that's fine. That's fine right there. In the floating in the middle in the middle of forever? Hold on, man. <laughs> it's like hey man. You know, just trying to keep this organized, trying to keep this stylish. How comes I can't put it on this platform that I spent uh, a good amount of time trying to put together? It seems like it would work. It seems like it would be big enough. Hmm. I guess I can't put it on. I guess I can't elevate it. All right. All right, well, okay. You know what? 
screw it. That's where it's going. We'll put it on this side. In between these two mines. Whoa, this is huge. Whoa, whoa, wee, whoa, whoa. Now, how comes I couldn't put this on top of that platform? Oh, this is going to be good. I might want to back up for this. Hold on. There it is. Huh? Word. Yo. Uh. Okay. Does does this take power? <laughs> Let's see. What's going on here, man? This is wild. This is a wild situation. Why do I have this still in my hand? Let's go ahead and put this away. Okay. Alright, so phase name, game phase, what? Get your game phase on! Load, seal, send. Alright, so we need reinforced iron plates and then rotors. Alright, well that's coming up inside of this next, uh, this next phase. Hold on, I gotta, I'm jumping, good thing, good thing there's a solid jump in this game, that's for sure. Uh, let's see, tier two, part assembly. We need a thousand of these, 300, 300, 300, 300, a thousand, jeez. Well, there's a hundred, there's a hundred, there's a hundred, there's a hundred, there's a hundred. Give me all of the copper wire, copper wire, copper wire, boom. See, this is what happens when you get, you get set every, set up everything and you'll get everything you need. Yar. Uh, let's see. Oh, I'm going to need more pipes. Well, it's a good thing I swing mad pipe. Giggity. Take that. Here we go. Now it's going to be like, how do you make things? <laughs> Rotors. It takes 15,000 of these and 35,000 of these. Oh my god. That's a lot of things. Milestone reached. Now we can more assemble. Assembly of parts can now be automated. Oh, more auto Oh, more complex. So check this out. We got this little watchtower here now too. Or we can watch all gem just take off there, Brian. Watch out for the watch out for the elevator, sir. Jeez. I'll tell you what, man, this thing is wild. And also I was messing around with some of the oh my god. I was messing around with some of the walkways before I don't want to fall to the don't want to fall to my, to my death. Just kind of testing it out, see what it's all about, see how it's placed. These things are a little funky. A little funky, a lot of funky. But it's nice. It's really, really nice. This thing is just, just gigantic. And I take it now. That we have some sort of airlock. This is all going out. You need to configure space elevator. Okay. Hmm. Hold on. Hold on. <sighs> Gotta do some landscaping. Oh, we need fuel. Yeah, I just needed that one. We're fine. All right. Okay, so it needs 75 reinforced stuff, uh, reinforced Iron plates, which we actually can make because we have all the parts and materials for it, but rotors. What do we need for rotors? Uh, oh, 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 oh. 
the assembler. All right, so it obviously doesn't need to have something like we can make those manually. It seems like because it requires for our assembler. I don't think I'm with the 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 amount of stuff that we have rocking and rolling throughout this uh, alpha weekend. Now, what does this need? Pipes and screws. Oh my god, we have tons of those. That it's not going to get uh, some stuff available for us until the full game comes out in about a week and a half or so. So as far as assembly lines, I'm not sure if we're going to actually need to do any of that just yet. But we are making plenty of pipe. That is for sure. Oh my god, I'm, <laughs> oh my god, I'm trapped. Alright, so let's go ahead. It's going to be a minute for the screws. I made, I made way too many uh, rotors. 25 more than I should have. It's a bummer, man. That's a real bummer. That's fine, though. All right, so we'll have this. We've got some. We have plenty of plates. Everyone, grab a plate. We have plenty of copper wire. Now it's just a matter of time for us to get everything we need to rock and roll. All right, now so let's get these pieces. Let's get these pats. Let's put it in here. Boom. Seal. Okay. All right. Oh, so it sealed it up. Oh, okay, cool. And up it goes. Check this out. A motor. I can't even make those things. Del delivery will unlock tier five and tier six. Okay. We're moving, we're moving, we're grooving, we're shaking, we're baking. Hut. What does that mean for us now? Good, good, good. Hey, tier three. Truck station, tractor, coal generator, scanning, update, coal. Oh, nice. Yeah, I did find a coal node. So we'll have to worry about mining coal now. Jump pads, we got all this, this same stuff here. It says, this ain't no big thing, chicken wing, you know what I'm saying? We might as well just select this and knock out the tier one. Tier two, just jump pads and a color gun. Okay, okay. And then cool power. <laughs> cool, this is cool power, no, coal power. Conveyor belt MK2, must go faster. Conveyor belt pole, stackable poles. So we can stack multiple conveyors on them, nice. And a rebar gun. There's so many things that are going on. Biomass. I already know how to do that. I don't, I, I don't need to know how to do that. Spite rebar. Ammo for a rebar gun. Ugh. Ugh. It's so good. It's so good. It's going to be a shame because I don't have, we're not going to have a whole lot of time to, to mess around with a lot of this stuff. Unfortunately. Mostly because... Mostly because... Uh, we just don't have enough time. We only have uh, two or three days. It's a, it's a bummer. It's a bummer, man. I'll tell you what, let's go uh, ahead and make some walkways here. Boop. This is, now, this is a bummer. This I thought was going to be something pretty nifty. But it was not meant to be, so I'm going to take it. I'm taking it back. I'm taking them all back. Goonies never say die. Boop. 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 Nifty. Spiffy. Lovely. 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 Uh, I mean, we're still going to keep this around. Just maybe not in the same form as it is. Because all of this, what I really should do is just make this the way that I want to make it. Just stop everything. Just stop everything. Keep the storage containers where they're at. And then just move it the way that we'd like to have it. But unfortunately, that's not, that's not going to happen. That ain't happening today. No, sir. How is this encroaching somebody else's clearance? Alright, fine. We'll just go this way. And let's see if we can make maybe a T.
Nice. This is pretty awesome sauce. I do dig it. See, what I would like to have is in the center have the hub. Have it maybe elevated above. And then this way we can actually look on left. The left hand side will be iron. Then the right hand side will be copper. And then the one, one area over here will be concrete. And we just have stacking and storage for those particular things. And then we can take those storage areas and then kind of converge them into one centralized storage area. These storage units are kind of cool, but at the same time, they're kind of not. I mean, you got to sort them out. It would be nice if we could actually have like a filter. Like a filter block or a filter something or other that we can sort and we can just say hey this this I want to have say like okay so right now for instance concrete we got uh, copper wire and we also have cables so if I had three stackable items three stackable storage units and I can say this one I want nothing but concrete this one I want nothing but copper wire and then above that I want nothing but cables and then make conveyor belt systems so that when these things come in they can still get sorted out through the storage units so it's not just everything that goes in here gets taken out and I mean this one's full already because we're just ridiculous it's ridiculous but this is nice <laughs> this is pretty sweet it's pretty lovely so we got our space elevator in. Now, what does that mean? I don't know. I don't. I don't quite know. All I know is that we can unlock a whole bunch of new things, new vehicles, new places to go, things to do, things to murder. But assembler. I'm trying to think like what two parts. I mean, yeah. I mean, we could take. Copper wire mixed in with this. I see what we can do with that. We'd have to rearrange. Like, I just got to rearrange this entire thing and knock it out the park. Like that's what it's gonna take. That's that's what it's gonna take. That's what it's gonna take. When you sit back and you're kind of like, all right, so what's the plan? What are we gonna do here? And you sit up on top of your tower, sit on your high horse on your high tower. And just go, okay, so here's what we're going to do over here, and it's going to spread out. It's one of those things where you got to visualize it, and right now I just can't visualize what i got to do to try and rearrange some stuff, and it'll just look terrible. It will. That thing looks fantastic, though. Everything in this game looks fantastic, just... Oh, no. Oh. It hates. So what is the next upgrade that we can knock out? Basics of exploration. We, we can just knock that out right now. I got the copper. I got the copper wire. I got copper wire coming out of my nose right now. I'm, I got I got nostril problems, and it's all copper wire related. Uh, and pipes. Boom. Nice. Nice. 100 of these. 250 of these. Launch! Tier 1 is done. Exploration basics. Reach. To ensure your survival and effectiveness when exploring xenoplanetary environments, you now have access to an object scanner and beacons. I don't know what you're talking about. What you're talking about, Willis? So over here is where we had the coal note. The see? See? We got some coal. I found some sulfur, too. And you find a bunch of different things. I don't even... Uh, this isn't really a node, is it? That's a bummer. I'll take that, though. I'll take you. I'll take you. Get some trees. Some bushes. Hey, tiger. Are you a good witch or a bad witch? Hi. Oh, you're bad. <laughs> Always buy it. Always buy it. A quick question. How does this fail? I really wanted to chop that guy in half. I really, really wanted to. Can I even do this to you? 
Nope, sure can't. Sure I'm dying. Sure I'm dying real fast. Alright, now we know. Oh, some berries. That's some wonderful juice. Some berries. So, I'm gonna mess around with this for a little bit more. And see if we can unlock some cool things. But as of right now, I'm really uh, stuck in the quandary. Because everything else we have to kind of... Not even just kind of. We gotta maneuver some stuff around. We gotta... We gotta take and... Take and, take and, and shake and bake and baby. Shake and bake. See, they're so loud. They're so loud. But everything works. Hey, and it's coming back. Is it back? Yeah. Baby, it's back. It's fantastic. Space elevators rocking and rolling. I know that when the full game comes out, it's just going to be me making foundations and making sure that everything looks okay. Because that that's it's going to be a problem, bro. That's you know, I got to be able to. It's going to look nice. Like right now, this is not this is not fun. I'd like to see if uh, maybe just maybe that the grass could not grow when you place down a foundation. It's going to cause some issues. Gonna ride the roller coaster, brah. All right, so now we're just in tier two jump pads, color gun. All these things are easily attainable and unlockable. Right now, I have twenty-five of these. This is gonna be still be a pain in the butt. So we still got some screws to mess around with. Everything's gonna take screws, dog. Everything's gonna take screws. Rebar gun. I mean, and then after this tier, that's it. That's a wrap because uh, unavailable in alpha, unavailable in alpha. Everything is. A mess. Well, it's just uh, not available. Gotta, this is a free taste. It's a free taste. The next next one's gonna cost you. So jump pads. We can unlock all this stuff here, and that's what I'm gonna do. Because in order to get the uh, next phase on the space elevator, we need motors. But motors are not unlocked right now in this game for us. It's a shame. It's a shame. But folks, we have unlocked the space elevator. We've seen its its splendor, its glorious, its gloriousness. You've seen my in inability to create efficiency. It's a good day. <laughs> hey, it is a fantastic day. What is that? Hold on. Is that a slug? Are you a slug? I could totally use you, slug. Here's a slug. I'll take you. The green power slugs, we can make some batteries and overclock the crap out of this stuff. Hold on. Uh, I just want to be able to have this elevated so I don't have to worry about coming down, <laughs> excuse me, coming down here for any reason other than just checking out some parts. Power shard. Nice. Now, can I put these power shards in here? I can. These are what really is just knocking it out of the park. Oh, yeah. 150. Look at this. Oh. Oh, yeah. Just get that power moving. It's rolling. But, folks, uh, like I was saying before, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. Helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week, folks. Have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Let me up here. Peace out, like shout y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Satisfactory next time. I wonder how I'm going to get a screenshot of this. Looks like I'm not going to... Can I make it? Can I make it? I can't make it. Ow. <coughs> Ow. Ow. Help. Ow.